If only my hand was bigger, I could capture the entire world! What? I'm still growing. What's up guys, it's your favorite YouTube commentator, Ghost Robo, and we're here back at Bane. You'll notice I've got a friend with me, Hell Reaver, who is Mr. Ryan on YouTube, graciously accepted my invite to help me out, and he's level 24, so I think we should be in pretty good shape with him. Thanks for all your feedback from last episode. Yes, Killer Croc dying was probably the end of uh, that little first run there, why I died so quickly. But I like that you guys know all about this game somehow and can, can always help me out when I'm, I'm missing one or two little things here or there. I greatly appreciate it. Um, Hell Reaver over here is a sorcery user. He's level 24. He's got some pretty crazy cool attacks. I've already seen a couple of them as we made our way through this little instance. Uh, so I'm excited to see how quickly we can beat down Bane. Now I have created my Machinima character, the, the DCUO hero that is going to be up over on Machinima hopefully very soon. I've already sent them the video. It could be up at any moment. Um, but I think you'll really enjoy seeing what I create. I actually, you know, to tell you the truth, have more fun playing that character than I do this one. So I think I may do something special for you guys and have like a an hour-long DC movie later this weekend and where all I do is play that character, show you the different side quests and things from the hero perspective in Metropolis. Now, I think we've destroyed enough of these barrels. It's time to go take on Bane. I've got the strongest guy behind me, Hell Reaver. We have no problem. Let's go. Let's activate this mission. Let's see how quickly we can uh, make this happen. I'll be very interested to see, you know, with a level 24 guy, with two of us, how, what kind of quick work we make of Bane. We'll use our uh, lightning power here right from the beginning. And now, let's hit him with some uh, ice zappies and see what Hell Reaver can do. This will be pretty fun because we'll get to beat Bane, I presume, and then see his cutscene and move on to the next line of missions. So you'll get to see a lot, hopefully, in this episode, sort of make up for the stalemate episode we had last time. Um, and I apologize for the slight delay in these videos. Guys, I'm, I'm really got a lot on my plate right now. And I'm trying to uh, do a handful of different LPs, Let's Plays, all at once. So please bear with me. DCUO content will still be coming. And, and also, that Machinima thing took me quite a bit of my time um, this week. Just, just getting adjusted to their whole format. Getting everything, you know, to their standards. And now that I have that sort of uh, format down, it'll just sort of fall in line with all my other videos and be a, a typical... Just a typical routine, but it did take a couple hours just to get everything set up in that way. And yeah, Bane is going down quickly, Lee. We're making easy handiwork of him. Let me get in here and, and do some damage. Gosh, we're getting smashed by these boulders. And I think Bane is done for. Drain Bane's venom. Where is he? Where's Bane? Where's Bane? Where is he? Where'd he go? Supposed to drain his venom. I don't I don't know. Oh, there's these venom crates. We gotta get rid of these so he can't, I guess, recharge. Let's throw these. So man, if, after we beat Bane. He could have uh, come back, I guess, if we didn't drain his venom there. Oh, there was Bane. Never mind. We weren't supposed to attack the uh, <laughs> the barrels. I guess he was sitting right here. I missed him with Hell Reaver and his little uh, little summon dude there. Let's check out the vault. This is the whole group loot thing. That if you're in a group, you can decide if you want it or not. I definitely want them. I need them. You don't need them, buddy. It's the, it's the item from Bane, so we'll definitely take those. Let's talk to Killer Croc. See what he has to say here. What's up, Croc? You ain't gonna be the big man for long, Bane. Uh oh. Cutscene time. Sometimes I wonder why I stay in the stinking polluted city. The Falcones, Bane, Two Face, Mad Hatter, that hush freak, Killer Croc, Catwoman, not to mention the Joker. There's too much competition. But I'm a businessman and I smell opportunity. So when this little gang war blows the lid off Gotham, Bane's gonna have a nice little umbrella for when it starts raining blood. <laughs> Alright, so apparently Penguin is the next guy on our list. He had a goofy voice actor there. I thought that was kind of silly, especially that tacky little laugh at the end. Defeat Bane without using any consumables. Yes, we did. We didn't use any health items. Let's exit the lighthouse, gain our XP. Maybe we'll level up here. Alright, complete the cape. Carmine Lighthouse without being KO'd. Very good. Let's get out of the way here before we uh, level up and jump out of the way. I'm guessing we're going to get a lot of XP. We got a lot of feet points there. So the beatdown for Bane, Bane is going to be complete. 25,000 XP, that's a lot. Fast. I have a sneaking suspicion his venom's been tampered with. For now, head back to the safe house. More awaits. Bane 
All right, so calculator says, "Hey, get back to the safe house." So we're gonna go meet with Catwoman. So Run around here. Uh oh. My gang war. I have to think of who to put in harm's way next. Uh, Two Face, Hush, perhaps even the Penguin. So many possibilities. Now run along and speak with Catwoman at the safe house, and we'll talk again soon. Ta ta. I never realized how much of a villain Catwoman is. I always thought she was just sort of like an anti-hero, but I didn't know she wasn't a strict villain. Or maybe she's not. Maybe she's portrayed that way in this game. I recently read The Long Halloween, the, the Batman graphic novel, and that was absolutely fantastic. I definitely recommend it if you're enjoying this game, go check out the book The Long Halloween. I'm sure many of you have already read it if you're big DC fans, but it's by uh, Jeff Loeb, and it was great. I read through it in, in one day, um, probably in only an hour or two. It's, it's short, um, but there's a lot of uh, good stuff there. I, I thoroughly enjoy it. Gotta give strong, huge props and recommendation to Batman's The Long Halloween uh, so go check that out. we got a lot of running here to do. Let's see, is Hellreaver following us? Alright, we'll let you stick around. Hopefully you don't steal all of our XP. <laughs> As you are level 24. I don't feel like we need to fight these level 1 guys anymore. No more of these cops. Um, and as I played through some of the hero stuff, I kind of enjoy Metropolis more than Gotham. There's some taller buildings. It's a lot larger, so there's you know more travel time. Um, but it just feels cooler, and I can't wait to show it to you in my Machinima video or in my little hero hour-long video that's going to be coming probably this weekend, maybe a little bit, maybe early this this next week, I don't know. We'll try to get it up this weekend, try to upload. You know, a lot of times, guys, it's not even me who's not going quick, it's my computer just can't, can't do a million things at once. I can't upload six videos and export six videos and, you know, export six audio recordings and it's just, it's a process. And a lot of times, it's my computer, actually, almost all the time, it's my computer slowing me down and not me slowing down my computer. All right, Hell Reva. He's a very cool guy. We could just stand and look at him for a second. He looks pretty cool. I like his whole little lava mask, crazy fat look. <laughs> and now we got to go speak with the Catwoman. Where's she at? Catwoman, 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 All Catwoman. Here you are. What do you got to say? Venom. I'll remember to keep you on my short list. Okay. She didn't say anything. Press start to access journal. Are we completing, like, a larger quest here? Bane banished, all right. Hmm, yep. More XP. Now what? What do we do now? Oh my, firing some, some dual pistols there. Do we have a mission? That's queued up. We got the demon inside, but this is from, uh... That is from... Metropolis when I was over there during that dual commentary. What do we have right now? Uh, I don't want to activate that one. Earning respect. Into the Hall of Doom. Arena. We got a lot of quests here. Alerts. Legends. I kind of feel like there should be something else popping up. These are level 12 quests. Attack Brainiac. I don't really want that one. Well, let's leave and see if a mission pops. Maybe something will pop up for us. And then we can use that. Actually, while we're here, how about we buy some soda coal? Always a good idea to stock up on health items, right? There's the Hall of Doom. Don't need to go there right now. Let's talk to Fast Freddy. Let's see if he has any soda colas to sell to us. We don't have very much money. And it doesn't look like he has any health. What about Agent Jaina? Yeah, I do need some goods. I need some soda colas. Do you have any soda cola? Yeah, there we go. Six pack for 180 bucks. We'll take that. We will take it. Now we gotta equip it, right? So go here to our inventory screen. And we will equip the Solar Cola. Alright, what is this? This is Barb Shoulder Guards of the Enforcer. Huh. I don't... doesn't mean it's taking away health and might, but it's giving us defense, power, and precision. I don't know. We'll equip it. Sure. Sounds good. It was a special blue item, so I'm guessing that means it's magical in some way. Let's exit this safe house and see if we can pick up a mission. Run and run and run. I'm using acrobatics for my hero. Um, and that's actually a lot of fun. You can somersault your way up buildings. Kind of feels like you're swimming, and the glide is really powerful. You know, you can glide off buildings for a long way. And when I, like I said, for, for, for whatever reason, I'm oddly enjoying that character much more. Um, the build is dual pistols, nature, and acrobatics. And it's a fun combo. I like having that heal spell. You know, all those times I died in early missions? Well, I didn't die once as the hero in early missions. Probably because I know a little bit more about the game. But also because I have that healing spell that can just back me up when ever I need it, 
and it's quickly activated and it's very useful. I think uh, nature is probably a good one for soloing as well as ice. Where do we need to go? I wish we had somewhere to head. Are we going to pick up a mission? Like what? What are we supposed to be doing here? Kind of a, a dead zone. I didn't realize we were going to hit a point where we didn't have a direct mission to accomplish. Let's see. I kind of want to throw away all these Metropolis quests. So they just get in the way. Hell, Trigon, that's Metropolis. Earning respect. Yeah, that's just a side mission. Meet Brother Blood. That is from uh, Metropolis. Mm, attack Brainiac. No. Into the Hall of Doom. Uh, no. Legends. Ace Chemicals. Use this fight. Use the Join the fight. Use the on-duty tab. Your communicator. Enter the Legend Simulator. I don't know what that is. Don't really want to do that. Where's our main mission, guys? Well, okay. I guess we'll just kind of run back. Let's go do the Hall of Doom one. I know someone said they wanted to see Hall of Doom previously. So, we'll go see the Hall of Doom. We beat Bane. I thought we'd get a Penguin quest, but apparently not. I don't know why it's not triggering. Do we have to, like, raise up to level 11? Or what's going on? Let's make our way to the Hall of Doom. We'll go check that place out for you guys and see. I think it's just like a, a hub. I think it's just, you know, you can go and, and transport to Metropolis that way. Do those sorts of things. But we'll activate that quest and we will uh, see what's up because I'm, I'm really surprised. Why am I not getting anything to pop? I'm sure there's some obvious reason you guys will be like, oh, Ghost Robo, it's just because of this or that. I just can't figure it out where we're supposed to go. So into the Hall of Doom will be activated. Sounds good. Calculator. And let's, uh, let's go check my mail, actually. Uh-oh, calculator. You're invited to the Hall of Doom yes. To hang out with the secret society of supervillains. And you thought your villainy went unnoticed. Use the nearest teleporter, and I'll show you the ropes. You're now ready to chill out and put heroes on ice. And your new tank roll. Okay, whatever that means. I don't, maybe, did he give us something? What's this guy? Your videos are awesome. Thank you, Cobalt Bullet. What'd you give me here? Let's see what you gave me. I got a nice little present here. A Wendell skin cloak. Let's check out if any of these things are of significant value to put on before we enter the Hall of Doom. Do, do, do. What is this one? Demon, Le Demon leather chest guard. That gives us a lot, but no might. I don't know. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Let's get rid of might. Who cares? I'm not about might. I like that. We'll use that guy. And what do we get here? A defender's loop of steel. We'll equip that guy. And then what was this cape? Yeah, that's pretty good. All right, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It definitely helps us out. You'll no longer be able to trade this item. That's fine. All right. Oh, man, look at that cape. And I think <laughs> that's pretty cool. So in honor of you, Cobalt Bolt, I'm going to wear this for the rest of the episode. A little bird feather-ish going on here. Let's enter the Hall of Doom. Complete this quest, and then we'll wrap this episode up. And, yeah, I'm pretty excited for you guys to check out my hero. I'm pretty excited for Machinima. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. I don't know how long processing time is, but I did submit that video here a day or so ago. Let's go to the... Uh-oh, here we are. I get a chill, don't you? Or maybe it's the air conditioning. They keep it low for Mr. Freeze. Ready to start your tour? Just follow your mini-map and activate the console calculator here. That impressive symbol is the mark of the tech wing. Tech using society members use technology. Okay, so I guess this is like a tour? We have to go on a tour of the Hall of Doom here? Uh, is this required? Is this optional? I don't know. Yes, now we have two different audio logs going at once. You can't hear what anything's saying. Metallo and the Flash's rogues gallery. Not to mention get the nastiest weapons and gear from the factional vendors. If it fires, explodes, or has pointy edges, they sell it. Here it is. Okay, so that's like uh, the uh, the specialist shop. I get a chill, don't you? Man, we just heard this last one. What? Maybe it's the air conditioning. They keep it Stop talking calculators. I'm gonna go through these guys pretty As fast here. Figured out. The Hall of Doom is like an enormous. Make our way through here. The more vendors. Yes. So blah 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 blah. But if you haven't earned enough renown with the factions. Whoa. Forget Hell Reaver, there's going crazy in the corner. I, I wish this dialogue was skippable, or at least like we could skip the little cutscene because it's kind of a uh, kind of tiresome to hear after a while. Continue on our way. Why is he saying this again? <laughs> it's the third time he said it. Access console and sabotage chamber. Okay. Ready to start your tour. At least we're getting XP. I guess it's worth it. There we go. I guess I'm ready to start my tour. I've been doing the tour for the last three minutes. The brokers 
and the command and control center here. You will also find the mailboxes in the main hall as well. All right, so there's some evil laughter. The Access console in the command death. center. Oh my god, calculator, you're yeah, saying the same thing you. over and over and over and over there, again. It's driving me crazy! Mr. And with that, guys, I think we're going to wrap this up. I'll complete the tour Just follow your outside to of YouTube action, because it's a little bit boring, I think. And uh, maybe maybe if you're a huge DC fan, you'd get a kick out of this, but I don't really... It doesn't ring any bells for me or, or bring back any memories. The gear lives. This room is so the we'll complete one more little... Uh, not counting me. Little cutscene thing here. Control. I want to say thank you very much for watching. Make sure to hit that like button if you like this video. I'll try to keep the episodes coming at a good rate. And until next time, guys, we will see you later.